beauty so today I'm going to be showing you my everyday fall makeup routine so let's go ahead and get started so the very first thing that I do every day that I wear makeup is I take my Too Faced Hangover RX 3-in-1 this is kind of like the little primer but this is really cool because it has the ability to be a primer, a setting spray, or a refreshing spray. And what I like to do is I shake it up and then I spritz my face and then I take my hands and I just kind of rub it in. The next step I do is I take these camouflage mix and drops turn me matte from hard candy. And what I do is I shake it up and then I take a few drops, place it on my hand. And then I will rub it in on the areas that are needed to be matte, like my nose, my T-zone area, basically. So the next thing I do is my eyebrows while this is mattifying. So the next thing I do is I conceal and color correct. I use the LA Colors Color Correct in Peach for my under eyes and my red areas. Then I use the Maybelline Fit Me just as my under eye and to highlight and kind of carve out my brows. I use the Photo Focus from Wet n Wild. So the next up is foundation. Lately I've been really loving the Fit Me Matte and Pore List from Maybelline. I just think it works really well for a day to day use. So the next thing I'm going to do is set, bronze, and bake my face to bake. I'm using the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder, the LA Colors Face Powder for my face, and to bronze I'm using the Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer in the color Light Bronzer. You guys, this stuff is amazing. It smells so good. I would highly recommend this. So now that that is done, I'm going to show you how I highlight my nose. I just still am using the Heaven's Hue Highlighter and Transcendence from Stila. This is amazing. I would highly recommend this, you guys. I have had this for over a year now. Still have a lot of product left. Still works amazing. And I just take a foundation brush I got from Walmart and I just apply that to the bridge of my nose. And I'm going to keep it out because I do use that to kind of do my brow bone highlight and a highlighter from Physicians Formula. I'm going to take the color Galactic. It's this nice pink color right here. And I'm just going to go above right here and set kind of that. And then set the point of my nose just to give it kind of a popping highlight. So the next thing I'm going to do is my eyeshadow. I'm taking the Naked Heat palette. And I have been loving using Sauced and Chaser, these two right here, as my crease color. So I'm going to show you that. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use the color Ounce right here. It's more of a skin tone color, just so it's kind of a lighter eye look so I can add more to the lash line. So really, the lower lash line color just depends on like what I'm doing, where I'm going kind of thing. But today I'm going to take this color called Bordeaux from the Chocolate Bonbon bon palette from Too Faced and kind of just smoke it in to my outer corner and my lower lash line. So the next thing I do is my eyeliner. I just do a wing liner using the e.l.f. liquid eyeliner in black. And then I layer the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara with the Unique Fibers mascara. I find that this works perfectly. It makes your eyelashes look really, really long. And then I also use the Maybelline Mega Plush Volume Mascara and the CoverGirl Fibers Mascara to my lower lash line and to kind of make sure I don't have spider lashes on my top line. And the last thing I do is highlight my brow bone and inner corner. I just take the Stila putty and I go right underneath my entire brow bone. I'm not sure if I do this right. I just do it the way that I like it to look. And then I will take the Physicians Formula Highlighter in Full Moon and that will be my inner corner highlight. And then again, I'll go for the Galactic for my brow bone highlight. So that is that. I set it with the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. And now for the lips as the last step, I will take this Wet n Wild Sugar Scrub, apply it to my lips, use a little bit of just regular chapstick, and then I will show you guys the lips that I'm going to be using for today. 
Next, I'm going to take these two lipsticks that I got from Influencer. This is in the color Joanna, and this is in the color Molly. Joanna is this nice kind of whiny red color. They're very sheer, so I want to apply this on the bottom and then use Molly as the kind of highlight in the middle. I think they'll pair really good together. Let's see if my thoughts are right. So that is the complete look. I hope you guys enjoyed my everyday makeup routine. Thumbs us up if you want to see a fall nighttime routine or morning routine. And I'll be glad to do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye beauties. Be beautiful.